abandoned baby hippo befriends two lovable terriers. Douglas was found all alone in the jungle with no one to care for him. The baby hippo was abandoned by his mother when he was only two weeks old and he didn't know how to fend for himself. Seeing how Douglas is a helpless baby, he was taken to the Chipembele Wildlife Rescue Center where he met Molly and Coco, the two white terriers. Douglas needs to stay at the rescue center for a couple of months because the rescuers don't want to release him into the wild until he grows to his full size. To everyone's surprise, Douglas instantly became best friends with Molly and Coco. This friendship is strange, but Douglas doesn't care about that. The baby hippo is happy that he has someone to care for him. One of the most amazing things about these three friends is that the terriers are teaching Douglas valuable lessons that his mother should have taught him. Keep watching to see what the first thing the dog showed Douglas how to do is. Hippos spend most of their days in the river and it seems like Molly and Coco somehow knew that. The reason I'm saying that is because the first thing that the two terriers did after getting acquainted with Douglas was to teach him how to swim. Isn't this amazing? The most incredible thing about this strange friendship is that the two dogs also nursed Douglas. They wanted to help the baby hippo build up his strength so that he could finally be released into the wild. What better way to cool off in the jungle other than to jump in the water? Well, this is why the rescue center created a special pool for the baby hippo. The rescuers wanted to make sure that Douglas is prepared to live on his own. The most hilarious thing about Douglas is that despite being just a baby, he is really heavy and the rescuers couldn't move him from the airplane to the rescue center. Six men were needed to carry Douglas. Can you guess how big adult hippos grow? While Douglas might be a baby right now, rescuers will need to build a special harness to move him when he grows up. Male adult hippos grow up to 5 feet in height and 15 feet in length. Can you imagine how difficult it will be to move Douglas once he grows up? The next picture is so cute that it'll bring a smile to your face. Just look how cute Douglas looks when he's feeding. The rescuers say that he needs to eat lots and lots of milk before Douglas can grow to his full size. In fact, this actually caused them some financial problems. Even though Douglas might only eat milk, which is not that expensive, he eats tons of it. This caused the rescuers to have some issues, especially since they just invested in building that new pool for him. How do you think they managed to get over this problem? Douglas had no other place to go and the rescuers knew that they were the only ones who could give him a chance at life. This is why they decided to start a donation campaign. You won't believe how much money they were able to raise. Thanks to the fact that Douglas is an adorable hippo with a sad story, he grabbed attention of many good people who donated some of their hard-earned money. Douglas' story raised more than $16,000 and these donations will be used to make sure Douglas is a healthy hippo. The donations made sure that Douglas had everything he needed. However, the two terriers were the ones who were actually making sure he is fine. Molly and Coco took care of Douglas right from day one and they shared a strong bond with the friendly hippo. Douglas has now been fending for himself since he was weaned in January and is surviving and thriving, said one of the rescuers. However, Douglas's journey doesn't end here. Let's see what they do next. The next step in Douglas's recovery is to join the wildlife, although this is easier said than done because other hippos might not want to accept him and this is why the rescuers are taking this step by step. The rescuers know that they're not in a rush to release Douglas back into the wild and they're doing it gradually. They take Douglas to the local river once or twice every week so that he can get accustomed to it and once Douglas is mature enough, the rescuers are going to leave him with the other hippos. Even though Douglas' story started off on the wrong foot with his mother abandoning him, he now has Molly and Coco to care for him and this is making him happy. 
I can only imagine how much fun this hippo is going to have when he'll grow up. Hmm? I can only imagine how much fun this hippo is going to have when he will grow up and start living in the wildlife with other hippos once again. One thing is certain, he has lots of exploration to do. The rescuers say that they'll keep looking out for Douglas even though he'll be released into the wild. They need to keep tabs on him in order to make sure that he gets used to his new home.